Okay guys, we're gonna talk a little bit about showing up to car meets by yourself. Now this is something that's very awkward, okay? You don't know anybody, you kind of pull into a car meet and you just don't know what to expect. Well, I'm gonna give you a couple of tips and hopefully you don't pass up the next meet because at the meet, you see some really cool cars and it's a good opportunity to kind of BS with people. So the number one thing is the way you show up to a meet, okay? I myself typically am driving along and I spot, you know, a bunch of cars in a parking lot. And so what I'll do is quietly park you don't want to be the guy that's, you know, shows up revving his engine and trying to showboat and everything like that. I just want you to know that the majority of the people that are meeting up likely have a custom exhaust setup with other modifications. You're not really impressing anybody and you're just increasing the odds of a noise complaint that could potentially ruin their meat. So don't be that guy, okay? Show up and park. The next thing is don't stand by your car, okay? Don't stand by your car and wait for people to be like, oh, hey, nice car, and ask you questions. Be proactive, okay? Get out of your car and start walking around. Try and find cars that you're genuinely interested in. And more often than not, people have their, their hoods open. You can check out their modifications. and if you know someone has a certain modification that you're thinking about doing ask them questions about their car i'll tell you there's one thing that car car guys can do the most do the best i mean and that is talk about their cars they love their cars um and put yourself in in their shoes if five people were surrounded about your uh, around your car couldn't you talk about your car forever I could probably talk about my car forever. Um, so all you need to do to a car person is just ask them one question and they'll give you a book's worth of information on that particular uh, topic. And more often than not, it branches out into other topics. Um, and so you're just basically opening up dialogue, okay? And, and it will likely turn into... Um, it'll likely turn into more. So, so you have your, your, uh, showing up, you have to be semi-social and walk around. And number two is learning how to open up to people, um, and, and approaching people. And that is by asking a question and letting them talk. Okay. The third thing is put your ego and put your knowledge in your back pocket. Okay, you, you don't want to get into a battle of wits with some stranger about their car and how much horsepower it's making or whatever. It doesn't matter because at the end of the day, it really doesn't matter. Who really cares if the person is saying that they have 20 more horsepower than what they do or they, it doesn't matter is what I'm trying to say. So. Put your ego in your back pocket. You're there to talk and BS and hang out with some some uh, some car guys. So uh, keep it light, keep it tight. And if you follow those steps, you will likely have a fun time at a meet. A lot of people will want to talk to you. A lot of people, after you talk to them about their car, will likely ask you about yours and eventually people will start coming over to your car and you can then be the center of attention but don't just show up to a meet loud annoying and stand by your car and expect other people to just start flocking unless you have some kind of insanely exotic car that people just can't help but flock to so you, um, let me know what you think.